guys welcome back to my channel this is going to be a reading for the person on your mind okay so think about the person that's been on your mind and we're going to tap into their energy if you're new to my channel welcome if you are returning welcome back please subscribe and comment and like if you enjoy the content i appreciate you being here and sticking around okay so uh, the person on your mind i'm gonna say keep it upright this may be a short reading guys i just wanted to do a quick check-in so four of wands okay there's something to do i feel like this has been coming up so much lately this is the 11 11 card this person could be going through like a big spiritual awakening right now. This could be your twin flame. This could be the person that you see yourself ultimately having union with. You could see this as your family, your sense of home, your sense of stability. But I also feel like this person is in the midst of trying to figure out like what their home is, what their stability is. So something in their, um, in their like home life is affecting them, okay? nine of cups okay so perhaps um they're in this place of like really dreaming i'm hearing hey now hey now don't dream it's over okay i feel this person's in a very dreamy state okay they're dreaming about it's almost like i i feel like a woman that's dreaming about a wedding okay um so it's like but there's also a seductive energy here it's like trying to control a situation in a sense so this person's really working on like manipulating an outcome that is right for them okay so what else do we need to know too many cards here you see there's something up their sleeve i don't know i feel like there might be even like a secretive energy with them it's like they're trying to protect something that um, they're trying to manifest or something like that. Okay. Queen of Pentacles reversed. Ace of Wands reversed. Okay. So, um, you guys could be dealing with like a karmic situation as well, where, um, like there's another feminine, like in the vortex of what you're trying to desire. Okay. There's a, de there's a strong desire here. Then there's like a feminine. I feel like you may feel like is kind of getting in the way, possibly, uh, this isn't, I'm not trying to do like a karmic reading at, well, I guess the karmic energies have been really intense lately, but I wasn't really focusing on the twin flame journey. I just feel like there is a feminine here that's not very grounded, that's not very stable, that's not really, um, this person could also be very indulgent. Um, I feel like this person has like really, this could even be like someone that has like really high standards, but to an imbalanced degree and it's like almost like they'll stop at nothing to get what they want there's a controlling energy here and i do feel like that has been really big in the collective lately there's someone who's really trying to control an outcome all right um we have seven of pentacles and we have two of cups um someone here is really working you know it's like i'm getting this like kind of manipulative energy of someone that really is working hard to get someone to love them this could even be you guys okay but there's this energy of like feeling like a lack or feeling like you have to prove your worthiness here um and um there is two of cups here there is four of wands but um there's like a a deficiency mindset here okay so you guys can resonate with that on some level i want to pull from the tarot of sexual magic here what else do we need to know that like i said the karmic energies have been like a lot lately you just may have noticed a lot of karmic energies in your life so let's just tap into that a little bit we have the hierophant reverse taurus energy um okay let's see this is like an unconventional attitude kind of this also could be spirit saying for you to let go of like old narrative old like outdated beliefs here okay like you might be viewing things through an even an outdated view that you had yourself and it's time to like break free from that because that mental narrative could be you see with the devil it could almost be like this um this like uh codependency 
thing here okay and then you have ace of swords someone is not seeing clear seeing things clearly either i feel like there's definitely someone that has blinders on here um there's could be a lot of like jealousy and envy and like addiction and like selfishness i feel like the selfishness and the um in the energy has been a lot lately where people are just really doing what they want to do they're not looking at the consequences of how it's impacting others i'm definitely getting that energy and then we do have a ten of wands here okay i'm hearing the word pleasure i'm hearing the word it's almost like a mistress that's like experienced so much pleasure with the person that they're like trying to manipulate it two of pentacles reversed and the uh star the moon reversed okay to me this is a very unhealthy obsessive energy okay it's like two people that got involved and they're like they have blinders on they're not seeing that it's not a healthy situation i almost feel it could be the empress is actually here upright I do feel this Empress upright is almost like this divine spiritual, like almost like the good witch in in um, Wizard of Oz who's trying to come in and spread the light because there's a lot of darkness right now. But people are so blinded by their obsessions, their desires, their they're not people aren't really watching their side of the street and they're creating bad karma for themselves by just blindly following their desires here okay could be pisces cancer energy doesn't have to be um and then we have interesting the world reversed here yeah people are definitely creating karma and they're creating 